thing. I love it. I really do love it. I like it. So, um, as Anna said, um, I have two little girls, two-year-old and a six-year-old. So, in our house, of course, we love fairies. We believe in fairies. I believe in fairies. I do, <laughs> I do, I do. So, and you know, fairies are wonderful. They're absolutely fantastic. We really do love them. But the only thing is, I've got an issue with fairies because they've never really modernised. Fairies have stayed as fairies forever. So, this first poem is just a little wake-up call to them and it's called Fairy Fail. You fairies are more than just fancy and fanciful. It's time to shine and be more fun and practical. A long time ago is now incredibly fey. Carpe diem fairies seize the day. You do more. You, your doing your image is tired and outdated. This life is yours, so God till you sated. Those leaf high heels may look cute, however, steel boots will weigh you down in windy weather. Gossamer wings are a pain for attracting dust. You'll get more wear and tear out of leather and studs. You're a unique individual, so embrace that fact. Get dyed, get pierced, get a human tattoo on your back. Yeah. <laughs> you're the size of a thimble, which is rather small, but when the sun hits those wings, your shadow's ten foot tall. Find your voice, shout out loud, it's time to be heard. You're a woman with wings, not a brainless bird. Stand strong, demand your rights, they're long overdue. The prince slayed the dragon, but he could never slay you. So sort it out, fairies, be true to yourselves. And when you've learned how, have a word with the elves. Yeah. <laughs>